Good morning. It is 4.30. I am on my way to work, like I do every morning. Hey, get the car warmed up. Cause it's kind of cold out here. Yeah. But, time to get the day going. What's up? So me and Michael's looking for some lettering. Um, I actually had a dream about this lettering that I did over my whiteboard. So I'm gonna go pick out some letters. I'll tell you what they mean after I get them. Let it be a little bit of a surprise. So I went with those because they're white, which means I can change them whatever color I want. Like I said, when I get home, I'll explain it to you more, tell you what it means. All right, so I'm home. Um, just got back from Michael's getting me some letters. Like I said, there they are. I decided to go with the white ones because, you know, I could always change those up. I can um, paint them, which is, actually, which is actually exactly what I'm going to do. And I'll be sure to let y'all see that also. Um, but... I'm gonna show them to you one more time, one to keep figure out what it's supposed to spell. If you can figure that out, comment below and let me know. But not only did I pick up some great letters, ugh, I also got something else. Whew. Look at those. Some brand new boxing gloves, baby. Black on black. Beautiful. I love it. Now um, I do do a little bit of recreational boxing, nothing serious, um, but I needed some new gloves because the last pair I used were taken when one of the coaches from my job moved on, so I had to give me another pair. And luckily, Academy had a great sale, and I got to scoop those up for pretty cheap, and then I got to combine two of my favorite things. I love all black um, workout equipment, um, like receiver gloves, boxing gloves cleats, things of that nature. So that was a win because I don't have to worry about them looking dirty. And then number two, I'm a diehard UFC fan. Even though I box, I'm more of a UFC fan. If I had someone to teach me, I would definitely do that. All right, so actually what I need to do is spray paint the first side of the letters so that they can dry while I'm giving my dog a bath. And then I can come back out after they dry, flip them over, spray paint the other side. I'm trying to get them hung up today. So that's what I'm going to do first. Now it's time to bath my buddy. Yeah. All right, y'all. So there you have it. I have my letters finally put up. And what it says is ex nihilo, and that's Latin for out of nothing. Now, true story, one night I had a dream that I had my studio set up. And although the layout of the room was a little bit different, um, I even had my whiteboards up different, I saw that phrase above the board. And of course, I didn't think anything of it when I was dreaming, because I mean, in your dream, you think it's reality. But when I woke the next day, that stuck in my head, and I remembered it. So I went and Googled it. And like I said, it stands for out of nothing. I thought that was perfect because when I had the ideas of the whiteboards, it was for me to take my ideas, my concepts, my goals and dreams and put them to paper. Or in this case, to the whiteboard. So out of nothing to something. So it was a flawless phrase and I had to do it. So I found the right letters, painted them the right color that I wanted, got them up, 
So there you go. That's why I got it. That's what it stands for. So I'm happy with it. And I actually like it quite a bit. But anyway, that's it for today's episode. Um, it took too long. It took two days. But you guys wouldn't have known that if I didn't tell you because of the way I edited. But anyway, it's finished now. All right, so I decided to forego my workout because we got a flag football tournament today. And for some odd reason, we picked up that guy. He's a soccer player. He doesn't even have thumbs. Can't catch anything with those. But we're going to win it all. I'm not going out there unless we win it. We're playing against some middle-aged guys. So I expect <laughs> us to really dominate them. Right? I hope they go, do. They're about to go kill you. Just because so I'm we're loading up on some Chick-fil-A. Love this place. <laughs> Alright, so I just pulled up to the field. Um, I'm scoping the competition. I could be wrong, but it looked like a whole bunch of people who ain't done nothing athletic in a long time. I'm calling it. This is about to be cake. We about to win the championship. Let's get it. So, we're in the championship game right now. Uh, we're 3-0, and but uh, I'm super tired. They put a lot of the workload on me, and it is killing me. So, uh, it's halftime. We're up 18-14. My team isn't playing so hot, so I'm trying to show it even more to load. But I'm not really coming off the field much. Uh, but 20 more minutes, I'm going to pay for this one tonight. I'm going to pay for it. But if we win, it'll be worth it. Whew, finish strong. All right, so it's over. We won the championship. We ended up winning 42-21. We exploded on them in the second half. Um, I'm really going to pay for this. My knees and my toes are already hurting. But it was a good time. Um, I go back to work. I got one session. Oh, it's gonna suck. It's gonna suck. It's gonna suck. But I gotta do it. Client has a very specific goal, very short time frame, so we gotta stick to it and get her there. But on the flip side, we had pizza out here, and this is all that's left. So we got six whole pizzas left. So I'm gonna take one. My buddy Q is gonna take one. And then we're going to find some homeless people to get the rest of it, too. I mean, we pass a few of them on the route that we take pretty much every day. So if we see one, it's pretty cool out here. It's in the 50s. So at least they have a meal. So that would be our good deed for the day, to finish off the day strong. Whew, let's get after it. A long day of football. This is what I got to do. Heating the knees up and let my mans beat my Achilles up with this ultrasound. I think I played too hard, y'all. Uh, I'm falling apart. I ain't even 30 yet. Imagine when I'm 40. Uh, so I'm home, and my body is pretty wore out. As you can see, I'm very ginger down these steps trying to take my dog out. And he's all but dragging me. But um, it was successful. Like I said, we won. Um... I had to play a lot, a lot. Um, in the championship game, we ended up winning 42 to 14. And I think I ended up with 30 other points. It was ridiculous, but it was fun. But I'm definitely paying for it now. Um, they had pizza out there for us, like I said. They had a lot left over. So um, I ended up getting to give a couple of them away to some homeless folks. I didn't get to record it because they didn't want to be on camera. So I didn't do it. Um, just respected their wishes. But I'm home now, I'm tired, I'm wore out, I'm showered. I'm about to eat a couple more slices of pizza and I'm gonna call it a night. The flag football day was a huge success and I'm really glad I got to do it. So, I'll see you good people tomorrow.